Okay, I have no idea which video this is going to go in. It might even go in its own standalone. And um, the, I, I will tell you, this is the Friday, the twenty second, the day the cap commiss, uh, the day the cap commissary. That word is hard. I don't know why. Event went live, and it did pick up these uh, Titan crystals. And if you're on the stream, you saw a long back and forth. And yeah, I'm going to talk about this because this is big. Okay. This is the first one I've ever opening. I, you don't know how often these are going to come around. And I was I put up the poll on the stream and I knew that the poll would say, yes, open it. Of course, because we want to see it. I want to show I want to have fun. I want to enjoy. And I thought that'd be very entertaining. Uh, Na, my friend Na, who works for the company, he's a recent hire. He's doing an amazing job. Kabam, way to hire a person like Na. We can see the difference in the game. It is great. It is great. It is great. The game is not perfect. But these hires you're making, uh, J Nick, DLL, Nah, like us players can see and feel. It is phenomenal. Keep doing it. It's great. Uh, he hopped on call real quick because you know he has the ability to do that, and um, and he's like, dude, don't open. I think you're gonna, you know, just chill. And I really appreciate the advice. Well, it's now like five hours later, and I've really thought this through. And the thing is with the Titan Crystal is there are still so many chances for quote unquote misses. They are very good champions. There are no bad champions at all in this crystal. What there are, are, what there are, are, are champions you really want. And I know that this is sitting there and it's going to be in the back of my mind being like, you should open it, you should open it, you should open it, calling out to me, right? <laughs> and I looked at it and yes, there are champions moving out of it that I, I'm, I'm not going to be as elated to pull. Okay, there are champions, I'm not even gonna say their names. I, I kind of almost don't want. But there's a champions, a bunch of champions I do want. And they will be coming in the next one. But I thought about it like I think Iron Man, you want at a high sig. I think if you were playing him, you're really using him the way I would you want to use him. I think you want him at a high sig. I am very intrigued by Vox, but I've already got Gamora and Venom now, who you who you may have just seen. We'll see which video I put this in. Also, that I want to rank two. Then there's Photon, and I really would want to pull Photon, but I would also want her awakened, and I've already got my six star rank four SIG 200, who I, you know, I hope I get a, a four or five science soon. I will take her up. So, you know, the Spider Ham's one worth waiting. I actually don't want Jabari Panther. Those look like who's going to be coming in. And so, what I've kind of come to the conclusion of is this crystal is going to be exciting or disappointing regardless. And waiting will just increase the value I'm putting on it and the importance I'm personally putting on it. Now, maybe you are immune to that, but I highly think, I, I highly doubt it. <laughs> and so a pool that I don't want, even if the champion is good, is going to hurt whether I open it today or two, three weeks from now, whenever Kabam changes over the crystal. And also, I know myself, I've played this game forever, the longer I wait, and I think this is the case with anything, the longer we wait, the more anticipation builds and therefore expectations build too. And when that item doesn't happen, we feel the hurt even more. So I'm either gonna feel hurt or I'm gonna feel good. Oh, if I don't get who I want today, I'll feel hurt and disappointment and maybe anger. <laughs> and if I wait longer, I'll just feel it more intensified. And also, I'm not that excited about what's coming in, except for Photon. Would want Photon, but again, like I said, because of my own unique account, I'm very happy with my six star right now. So here we go. It will also play into some of my current rank up decisions. I would love to awaken my seven star Lady Deathstrike. I think it will make a meaningful difference in her. I would also love to awaken Danny Moonstar. Well, all my uh complaints and gripes aside about danny i will take her to rank two today if i pull her if i get her awakened also i back to being done with the six star featured hopefully you saw that i opened up a couple i'm i'm done i want silk but i do think spot could potentially still be very good as a seven star even without the awakening and the rest of these champions i think you want them awakened like you really do so i'm just doing it now some of you might be like, you were talking yourself into that one. That is some motivated reason. Another, you'd be like, yeah, it made a lot of sense. It makes sense to me. I took time. I thought about it. This is just big. This is just, I'm making sure I'm recording. This is really big. I hope I'm happy. I'm going to be either upset or happy. 
or happy or upset, regardless of when I open this. Might as well do it now. The screen is shaking. The screen, you see that? The stand is palpitating. Palpitating. It is a big one. That's it. The game knows. This is massive. Let's get Danny. Let's get Lady Deathstrike. Let's get Silk. Do it. We can do this. We can do this, Kabam. Come on. Now. Now. I'd be pumped up on Mr. Negative. I'd be pumped up on Juggernaut for sure. I'd be pumped up on a lot of these champions. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. This is fun. This is fun. This is like when you're going up the roller coaster and you can hear the click, 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 and you know the drop is coming. You're about to have a blast. That's how I feel right now. Come on. Here we go. Now's the time. Let's go. Let's go. There goes Silk. This is quite honestly the worst pool in my, uh, for me personally, in the whole batch. Uh, I'm really glad I did not wait to get this. The reason why this is so hard is because uh, this was a community choice one. And um, I, I, I get it, I understand I believe I understand why he was selected. Um, I believe I understand why he was selected. From, uh, from the group that was there. You know, I think for players coming up and stuff, um, all these immunities, Uh, are really good. Um, and he's he's a fine champion. You know, watch. I'll probably rank him up and just realize I love him or something. Um, but at least as a six star, he really, really wants his sig. He really wants it back. And, uh, you know, the Titan Crystals aren't going to be coming around too often. He's not one of the champions switching over to the basic pool in October. And um, and we had the chance to pick, like, good <laughs> good champions. Uh, so this, this hurts. I am glad I did not wait for this level of pain. Uh, <laughs> I would... Right now, I'm just like, okay, fine. Um... But if I had waited for this, I think there'd be a level of anger inside of me. <laughs> that would be coming out. Uh, if you've opened yours, let me know how it went. Let me know if you're like, dude, that's a really good pull. Let me know, because I, I could use that. I could use being explained why this is such a good pull. Uh, maybe he is, and I just don't know it. Thank you so much for watching. I definitely hope your pulls are way better than what you just saw. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.